Itsuki, move it! Get your button gear, come on! Uh, uh, hey, Kenji, what's up, man? What's wrong with you, dude? Get your head out of the freaking clouds. I don't know what you're talking about. He's been acting this way for quite a while now. Who knows? Maybe he caught the daydream bug Takumi just got over. Come on. I'm not that bad. Oh? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Kazumi, what are you doing here? You get the day off? Is everything okay? Yeah, great. I hope I'm not bothering you at work. No, of course not. So, I was wondering what time your shift ended today. Oh, yeah? See, I'm free for the rest of the day, and I was hoping we could maybe hang out or something. But if you're not getting off soon, I can wait for you somewhere. Hold on. Can you wait here for a sec? Stay here. I'll only be a minute, maybe two. Just don't move a muscle. Ah! Ah! Huh? Huh? Sorry, but I gotta leave for personal reasons! What's going on? Ah! Itsuki, where are you going? Hey, wait! Hey, you don't mind covering for me, do you, pal? Come on, hop in! Are you sure it's okay? It's so okay! Let's go! <laughs> well, I guess I can give the boy a break. But just this one time. So, dude, who is that girl? It can't be his new girlfriend. Yeah, I think it must be something like that. That's such a load! Of all the guys to get a girl, you'd think it'd be one of us. Not Goofus the Magnificent. What happened to all that lonely driver bullcrap? Your boss isn't mad you left work? I, I don't want to get you in trouble. I told you, it's fine. These guys are always really cool about stuff like this. The boss may be a little ticked with me tomorrow, but... Hell, I don't care. This is totally worth it. I haven't been able to get Cosme out of my head all day. All I've wanted is to see her, and here she is. She came to see me on her own. I didn't even have to invite her. That makes me so freaking happy. That's why leaving work is no big deal. Even if I do get in trouble. It's funny. When I was growing up, I was always spending time with my brother. Yeah? That makes sense. The two of you seem like you're pretty close. Once he really started to get into racing, I would always tag along as his sort of sidekick. 
There was even a time when I was actually using my own salary to pay for his car expenses. Crazy. Uh, yeah. Only reason I did it was because I couldn't think of anything to do for myself. It was so easy just to follow him around all the time. But that's no way to live. We're so different. There's no getting around it. And me? I just need to figure out what to do with my life. Mm -hmm. Problem is, there's nothing I'm really passionate about right now. I just need to be patient, and I know I'll find my dream. <gasps> From the moment I got here, I haven't had anyone to talk to. That's why I'm so grateful to have met you, Itsuki. <gasps> Yeah, me too. I know it sounds cheesy, but I feel the same way. The true power is sealed away on purpose. Why would he do that? And it's a professional racing engine? I don't know what's going on anymore. Fine, then. I'm lacking, but you work with what you have. It got dark quick. I can drive you back to your hotel after we finish dinner, okay? Honestly, I don't want to go back tonight. Oh, that's cool. You can... <gasps> Something really crappy happened at my work today. Really? What? There's this co-worker of mine who's really mean. She's always blaming me for her stupid mistakes, and she spreads lies about me to our supervisor. It's getting to be unbearable. Well, don't worry. As long as you're feeling down, I'll stay right here with you. <laughs> I don't care how long it takes, either. You can count on me. <laughs> there. Steer into the turn while applying light brake pressure. Got it. <laughs> Whoa, you're pretty good at this. Thanks. I'm getting there. <laughs> I gotta say, Kazumi, you're a much better teacher than Takumi could ever be. I learned pretty much everything from my brother, when I would ride along with him. I guess it just stuck in my head somehow. Oh, yeah? Well, I got a hunch you're gonna be really good at this once you get your driver's license. Huh. Well, I'm not so sure. When it comes down to it, I'm really all talk. I can't race down a mountain pass by myself. Right, but that's not exactly what I meant. Racing's just one of the freedoms you get from driving a car. That's why I think you should definitely get your license. Because it'll open up a whole new world to you. You'll love it, trust me. You should look into going to one of those driving schools. You're so good at teaching me, I bet you could do it for a living. You never know. Stepping on the gas and steering with your own two hands. It means you got the freedom to go anywhere you want to go. It's the best feeling in the whole world. We'll settle this feud soon enough, and when we do, you'll never be able to brag about being undefeated again. I don't think there's any avoiding it this time. I have to race him. close to quitting my job and moving back to Saitama. But I think I might give it another try. Quitting might be the easy thing to do, but then I would just be right back where I started. What's up, buddy? Oh, uh, hey, man. So, hey, if anyone asks, just tell them I was hanging out with you all last night and into this morning, okay? Can you do that? Uh huh? You're just back? You mean just now? Um, yeah. Are you with Kazumi the entire time? Yep. Hey, what are you blushing for? Now, don't go getting the wrong idea. All we did was go to the past together. 
and then we fell asleep inside my car. Okay, but don't you think that's kind of a big step? I mean, she is a girl if you hadn't noticed. I know, but she said she didn't want to go home, so what was I supposed to do? I mean, isn't it the man's duty? Stick by his girl at all times? I don't know, man. And I'm really not the best person to ask, so... I can't tell you how happy I was yesterday. I couldn't believe how much stuff we had to talk about. I feel like we really bonded. It was like a dream come true. So, hey, what's going on with your love life lately, huh? Natsuki's been absent from school a lot these past couple of days. Or she's avoiding me, which I doubt. What's the deal? What, has she been sick or something? How am I supposed to know where she is? That's a weird thing to say. I figured you would know. Initial D! <laughs> Hey, Dad. I guess he must have left. Fujiwara Tofu Shop, how can I help you? What? Hey, sorry to call out of the blue. You're probably wondering how I got your number. It's just I remember seeing the sign for Fujiwara Tofu Shop on the side of your car, so I looked you up. I wanted to let you know I'll be in Gunma tomorrow to pick up my sister. Why? I heard that she took the day off of work yesterday and didn't even bother showing back up at the hotel until this morning. It's just she's so irresponsible. I swear, man, I really can't stand people who don't stay true to their word. I don't care if it is my sister. Sounds like Itsuki's in trouble. But enough with my problems. Let's talk business. I think it's about time that you and I had our race. So leave tomorrow night open if you're interested. Make sure your engine's fully operational by then. Otherwise, we'll just be wasting our time. I know you'll get it worked out. I trust you. I'll be in touch. Talk to me. Hey, what are you doing here, dude? Hey, man, I was kind of hoping I could ask you for a favor. Yeah? I may be racing the 8.6 turbo tomorrow night, and if I do, I want to make sure this engine my dad put in is fully tweaked and ready to be pushed to the limit. I need to install a new tachometer, so I really need your help. A tachometer, huh? Yeah. You know all about this mechanic stuff. I wouldn't even know where to start, so I need your help. I'm desperate. Please, dude. Will you please give me a hand? All right. I can't tell you any specifics just by looking at it, but from what I can see, this definitely isn't your normal street racing engine. Okay. Let's see here. Carburetor's good, and this head is wild. It's all twisted around. It's one of these new five-valve engines, and it looks like it's tuned to the hilt. I have a hard time believing this one has less power than that old one of yours. Well, that Wataru guy I'm supposed to race told me I'd get more power if I went to a higher RPM. And I don't know why, but I'm sure he was telling me the truth. Hmm. So he's talking about unlocking a sealed high rev zone. If that's what's going on here, it sure is exciting. Installing a new tachometer is easy. I could probably show you how to do it yourself if you wanted. But there still is one question we need to ask. Huh. It's about your dad. Are you gonna ask his permission? Or are you just gonna go ahead and change the whole setup behind his back? The way I see it, my dad wasn't home tonight. And if he were home, he would just tell me no, even if I got down on my knees and begged him. But he's not home, and I say we go ahead and do it. I can't wait for him. I want to get every last ounce of power out of this engine by tomorrow night. All right. That's exactly what I was hoping you would say, brother. I'll call in an order for a proper tachometer first thing in the morning. Then once you're out of school, get the car here as fast as you can so we can get started. Sound good to you? Thank you so much for your help, Ikatani. I can't tell you how much I appreciate it. Well, you and your 8-6 have saved my ass more times than I would really like to admit. Helping you find more horsepower is the least I can do. What? A week? Are you kidding me? I need one today! Oh man, I am so screwed. Nobody has one of these in stock. Demand for high-rev RPM tachometers must be low. What the hell am I gonna tell Takami if I'm not able to get one? Must be a special order part. Hey, boss. Do you know of anyone who could help me out? Let's see. Maybe. Hold on. Hello? Hey, Yuichi. 
Yeah, sure, I've got one. What? You're sure? You don't need to double check? Punta ordered one for his 8.6, and I've been sitting on it ever since. It's got a race and tachometer, water temp, and oil pressure. The whole setup. Hold on a sec. I can barely believe what I'm hearing. This must have been what Bunta was talking about when he said he was going to seal it. I tell you, kid, this is better than going to the movies. Masashi, I need you to bring those gauges over here right away. Can you do that? Hey, talk to me! Why the heck is he in such a rush? Natsuki. Takumi, hi there. I don't have time to talk, so later. No, wait! Takumi. What am I gonna do about that girl? Okay, now all you gotta do is screw it down. Yeah, just like that. All right, you're finished. Wasn't that easy? It actually was, but only because you two were here to help. If you hadn't taken pity on me, I'd still be standing here reading the instruction manual. You know, installing the new tachometer is only part of finishing the job. Just because it's called a high rev engine doesn't mean it can rev forever into infinity. Without knowing where it tops out, you'll never have a chance at racing at full blast. I'd have to think your dad would know the answer to that, because if you were to try racing it without knowing its limit, you could end up damaging it beyond repair. I'll have to ask him. Hey, is that who I think it is? It looks like you're ready for the big race tonight. Unless you've changed your mind, we'll proceed as planned. And, because I'm feeling generous, I'll let you pick the course. Anywhere you want. Isn't that the same 8-6 turbo we saw that one time? It is. And get this, that guy is Itsuki's girlfriend's brother. Uh, oh man, this is not gonna turn out well. Well, okay then. I'm fine with that. I guess that just about does it, so I'll be seeing you in a few hours. Later. <laughs> Takumi, what's up? Which of the passes did you end up picking? Wherever it is, we'll be there to root for you. <laughs> Haru? I can't believe it. How dare you? Didn't I warn you about making our aunt look bad, didn't I? Do you even care that you had mom and dad worried sick? I want you to pack up your stuff tonight, because first thing in the morning, I'm taking you back home. <gasps> Damn it, that's not your decision to make! Fine, it was the wrong thing to do, staying out all night without checking in. It was dumb, I get it. But everything I've done, I've done for a reason. I'm not ashamed of it. And I shouldn't have to be forced into going home for that. You can explain your side all you want, but it's mom and dad you should be telling it to, not me. If you really like it here so much, then go home and talk to them. Let them know how you feel and then come back. I can tell that you've changed in your time living here. And you can believe me or don't, but I think you've done a whole lot of growing up as well. I know you've matured, but our folks haven't had a chance to see it, which is why they worry so much. They'll feel much better if they hear it coming from you. Okay, fine. I'll go back home then. So what's going on? Nothing. Just trying to get prepared for the big race tonight. What big race? You didn't tell me you were racing! Wait, hold on. It's not against Cosme's brother, is it? Yeah, it is. And if you don't mind, I have a favor I've been wanting to ask you. I'm a little spooked going into this one, so would you be up for riding along? Yeah, of course I am, dude. Anything for you. You're the best. Pick you up in a little bit. Is it, son? Okay, here it is. I just wanted to let you know that I'm racing tonight. I put in a new tachometer. 
Now all I need to know is what the top RPM is. Will you tell me? You'll want to rev it up to 11,000 RPMs. <laughs> Don't you dare lose. Thanks, Dad. I owe you one. Hey, talk to me. What are we taking the highway for? Wateru gave me a choice and told me I could pick any course that I wanted. That was nice of him. So where did you pick? I settled on Shomaru Pass. You did what? Don't you know that's Wateru's home turf? Takami's new engine versus Wataru's turbo. This'll be a good one. Next on Initial D, second stage. 8-6 versus 8-6. A spirited race. Don't miss it! <laughs> 